Hi and welcome to my Mystery Rehash YouTube channel. Today I'm going to explain a super hit Bollywood movie called KGF Chapter 2. Spoilers ahead. Watch out and take care. The KGF franchise is said to be grounded on the life of Thangam, an unrespectable criminal from Karnataka, who was shot dead in a police encounter in 1997. He's said to be the most dreaded criminal from the state after unrespectable sandalwood smuggler Virapan. It's said that Yash's character Rocky in KGF Chapter 12 is stealed by the bio of Thangam. KGF film, which traces the story of Rocky, Yash, a young orphan who grows up lonely to become a gangster in Mumbai, takes us to the Kolar gold fields in Karnataka, India. According to Paulina or Puli, her sons, or he's been portrayed in this film without her authorization. Previously, also she had filed a plea seeking stay on release of KGF Chapter 2. Puli was of the opinion that the first part of the KGF ballot has portrayed her son in a negative light. Puli claimed that this was done despite the crew promising her that Thangam's character will be shown in a positive light. On the other hand, the makers of the movie claim that the movie isn't grounded on the life of Thangam. Director Prashanth Neil truly denied knowing about Thangam's real-life story. There may be contradictions between statements of the makers of the movie and Thangam's mom, but according to numerous reports, KGF is grounded on real-life incidents. The work of Rocky is described by reports has took up a lot of references from Thangam's character. According to reports, Thangam had a sum of 42 cases pending against him. He also enjoyed a Robin Hood look-alike as he distributed a share from his spoil among the needy. According to some reports, he'd been a worker at Kohler Gold Mines and formed a gang there. This game would also go on a sacking spree of gold from mines. After creating a lot of trouble for the administration, Thangam was shot dead by police on December 27, 1997. It occurred in Kuppam of Chidor section in Andhra Pradesh. The police afterward killed three of Thangam's sisters in Hassels, Thangam, Gopi, and Jay Kumar. While Gopi and Jay Kumar were fired deadly in July 2003, Sagam was killed in October that time. Their mom, Puli, filed an appeal seeking a CBI inquiry on the encounters, and in 2012, decorated police officer Ramesh Kumar was charged by the CBI for giving the encounter of Sagam along with six others. <laughs> 